I really, like you make me feel so comfortable. So thank you so no, much. No, no, you're making me feel comfortable. This is fun now. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Melissa O'Neill. I'm a second generation Chinese Canadian born to an immigrant mother from Hong Kong. Hi, Melissa. My name's Tony M. I'm a public information officer for LAPD Media Relations. What I love about being AAPI is the fact that we have a very large Asian community. And sometimes when officers respond to calls, there's like a cultural barrier or language barrier. And it helps when I show up because I can ease the situation and provide comfort to the victims. What I love about being Chinese Canadian is that it, it's been a process of discovery as an adult to reintroduce myself to my heritage. I didn't grow up with it so much. What I noticed after The Rookie was airing was I was getting messages from young Asian women about how much it meant to them to see someone who looked like them being portrayed as like a fleshed out human being. You know, one of the storylines with Lucy Chen that I think a lot of Asian families can relate to is the one where Lucy's parents have high expectations for her and might not totally agree with her career path. My parents didn't exactly agree with or disagree with my career path, but they did hint and encourage me to make sure I had a backup plan. Luckily, they don't feel that way anymore. The first time I saw somebody on TV that looked like me was on Star Trek, and it was uh, George Takei, and I was very excited to see him on uh, national TV. It makes me feel like I'm part of the world and I'm part of the community. I think it's very important to have representation on TV because it shows the kids that Asians matter and that we can be actors, we can be police officers, we could be anything that we want to be. I think normalizing seeing all different colors and all different people from different backgrounds entering into fields that they wouldn't otherwise think are open to them is crucial because it ripples forward in television and also in the world behind it. it it's very important to be a role model because I've been serving the community members for over 23 years pretty soon I'm gonna have to retire and pass on the baton. And I need a new generation of Asian Americans to take on this role of mentoring and, and protecting the community. I'm super in awe and I'm, I'm just so grateful for your service and the, your heart in service, so thank you.